Do you ever have a hard time making a decision that on paper should be a fairly easy decision to make, but for some reason you feel conflicted? Well, here's why that could be the case. Being confused about what to do next is a symptom of something that most of us don't do for ourselves. And that is most of us don't develop a clear working definition of success. What we do is we just adopt society's definition of success, which usually means be comfortable, make a lot of money, get a nice house, drive a nice car. But that definition doesn't work for everyone or for every situation. What if you want to join the Peace Corps? What if you want to quit your job and follow your passion as an opera singer, right? The reason why those kinds of choices are considered risky is because they don't fit into the conventional definition of success. So therefore we get confused and conflicted, even though everything in our heart is telling us to do it. We're like, uh, I don't know. But what if you define success as following your inner guidance? period. Or what if success was speaking your truth or being around people who inspire you creatively, then doing things purely for the money aren't going to make sense. It doesn't have to be one or the other, but that could be one of the main reasons why you're confused about your next move because you haven't defined success for yourself. So take a moment and define it or take longer than a moment, but Ask yourself, what does success look like for me at this point in my life? In other words, if I'm not concerned about impressing anybody else, how would I spend my time? What would my professional contribution to society look like? It sounds simple, but this one thing can either make you doubt yourself to no end, or it can help you create a powerful shift in your life. Because once you have your clear working definition for success, all of the other decisions are going to be that much easier to make. You're not going to waste time going back and forth about something that's not aligned with your idea for success. And if you've already done this, but your decisions are still not that easy to make, that's a sign to go back and rework your definition until it's more authentically aligned with you and not somebody else's definition of success for you. Thanks and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for watching. I add new videos daily, so make sure you click to subscribe so you don't miss out. And if you want to see the next insight, just click on over to the right. You can also follow me on Instagram at Light Watkins, and I look forward to seeing you next time.